Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to set up Unity so you can build and support your virtual or extended reality project as an SPK ready for the MetaQuest 3. Whether you're starting with your demo or you know creation, let's get it up running on your headset. Step 1. Check the XR plugin management. Before touching any build settings, make sure your project has the XR plugin management package installed. Go to Window, Package Manager, and switch to In Project to see what's already installed. If XR plugin management is missing, switch to Package Manager to Unity Registry. Search for com.unity.xr and install the latest version. Once that's done, go to Edit, Project Settings, XR Plugin Management. Under the Android tab, activate OpenXR. That's the best choice for MetaQuest 3 and future proofing. Expand the OpenXR settings under the Interaction Profiles and make sure MetaQuest support is enabled. Confirming everything is good, check the Project Validation Setup tool inside Project Settings. Unity will highlight anything missing or misconfigured. Just hit Fix All or Apply All, clean things up. This is the best way to avoid most build errors and headset issues later, so definitely don't skip it. Step 2. Set up Build Platform. Now, let's switch the build target to Android. Open File, Build Profiles, or File Build Setting if you're using an older version of Unity. Select Android from the platform list, then hit Switch Platform. Pro tip. Make sure your scene is included in the scenes build. If your main scene is listed, add it. Otherwise, Unity won't know what to export. And yep, check that project validation tab again before moving on. Step 3. Connect your MetaQuest 3. Plug your Quest 3 into your computer via USB-C. Make sure developer mode is enabled in your MetaQuest mobile app. If you're not sure how, check the description. I've got the full video that walks you through this step by step. Back in Unity's build settings, select your Quest 3 as the room device. If it doesn't show up, leave it as the default device. Unity usually still pushes the build to your headset when developer mode is on. Step 4. Build the APK. Ready to roll? Click Build. Choose Location and name for your APK file. Sit back for a bite while Unity does a thing. It may take a while depending on your project size. Step 5. Sideload to Quest 3. Once Unity is done, you will need to sideload the APK onto your headset. You can use Save Quest. If you are new to sideloading, Check my other video, where I guide you through using SideQuest step by step. After installation, put out your Quest 3, head at new source, and you should see your app waiting for you. And that's it, your project should now be running on the Quest 3. Thanks for hanging up. Drop your talks in the comments, and let me know what other Quest 3 dev tips you like me to cover. See you next time.